the feast was kicked off with this fireworks display. I mean, it was just a small fireworks display, but it was like popping and just like, okay, the feast is beginning. And I got to tell you, when you're starting a feast with fireworks, <laughs> I mean, it's just adding to my level of excitement. I'm ready to eat. I'm ready to eat. You're going to start me off. You're starting off dinner with some fireworks. Let's eat. Sounds like, sounds like a meal. I actually, I ate so much of the vegetarian food that I actually hit a level of depression when the meats came out because sweet and sour pork is one of my all-time favorite dishes. That dish showed up looking that juicy orange red, just dripping, just, mm, I don't know what's in there, garlic sauce, it's just like, I just, <laughs> I didn't want to fill up on rice. I'm just looking at this meat with pineapple, and the pineapples here are so juicy, way juicier than back home. I mean, so I put the pork and pineapples on my plate, and I was able to get through like one and a half, and my stomach said, uh-uh, you can't eat anymore. I'm like, come on. I haven't even eaten a normal portion, and I was full already, and I just all of a sudden, I was like, dude, this is the saddest thing ever that I cannot get through my favorite dish. I, I mean, normally, I could eat a, an entire pork dish, and uh, I mean, my belly said stop, and so I thought about taking a pause for a little while and then maybe being able to continue a little bit later, but uh, my stomach was full for the rest of the time, and so there were a couple of dishes that came out later, the snake dish, and um, uh, what else came out? Pig knuckles and you know there there was like ten dishes and James is going to town. He was just eating everything. I could not believe how much food he ate. He must have eaten at least three times what I ate. I probably actually ate less than anybody else. I know Courtney ate more than I did, so I figure everybody probably ate more than I did. But uh, I mean, I definitely ate my belly full, and uh, I. I'm one of those people who would rather eat and be comfortably full than just kill myself and want to throw up or feel sick later on. I didn't feel sick, I just felt full and I felt full all day. Um, but not finishing, not, not eating very much of that pork is like, oh man, all night I was just dreaming of that pork, just wishing I had it to take. <laughs> I could eat that pork every day. Uh, I would be satisfied. If you told me I had to eat that pork every day for the next year, I would be very happy with that. Here I am at dinner with the final 10. Some of these people I'm just meeting and hanging out with for the first time, especially Eric and PG. And uh, I got to tell you, just eating and enjoying, I, I think I forgot about the game for a minute. I just kind of got lost in the food and the enjoyment of the moment and just so happy to be there without even having to work for it. I mean, we did not even have a challenge and here we are enjoying this feast and that was on the forefront of my mind. You know, if I could redo yesterday or if I could redo that, uh, that time, I would say, hey, you know what, maybe I should pay a little more attention to detail, but it was a euphoric time for me and uh, I was just enjoying my feast.